I'm Paul Moss, I'm Professor of Haematology at the University of Birmingham. So I trained in medicine at the University of Cambridge and I went there, I thought, I think when I went I thought I was going to be a cardiothoracic surgeon and then um, I started to love the science and got into the science of medicine and human health. So after that I went to Oxford, finished my training, did some jobs in London and did a PhD in, in immunology and trained in haematology, that's blood diseases. And I came to Birmingham at the age of 36 to start the academic department of haematology and I've been here ever since and to be honest you know with my colleagues we've done a good job and grown it very strongly so that's my academic background. My primary interest is on study of the immune system in human health. The three main areas of interest the first is how the immune system targets cancer and the fight against cancer. The second is how the immune system is important in uh, bone marrow transplantation or stem cell transplantation. And finally, I'm also interested how our immune system can control chronic viral infections and the importance of that to human health. I think one of the best periods in, in science was when I was involved with some of the first work on reagents called HLA peptide tetramers with some colleagues from California. And these were uh, little molecules that were able to identify white cells or T cells against a specific virus. And we studied these in patients who got HIV infection. And we were able to pull out from blood samples HIV specific T cells. And I remember when we first did this experiment, I was actually at my parents' house and my colleague was in the lab and he rang me up one night and showed that he'd identified. That was a very exciting moment. And that paper's been cited over three and a half thousand times. So what we then went on to do was to develop a technique where we could take these CMV specific white cells or T cells from a transplant donor and put them directly into a patient who was suffering from viral disease. And we did the first trial of that in the world and, and the results are very interesting. And it's really exciting that that's now gone on to various trials in this country and around the world. I think the aspirations for the future are to raise the performance of the lab even more to take advantage of the opportunities of immunology and immunotherapy in improving human health. And we really want to tackle uh, the immunology of tackling cancer, controlling cancer, and also chronic viral infections, where I think we've got a real opportunity to improve human health and even extend human lifespan. It's very exciting. Mm -hmm.